Hey guys and girls, what's going on? Warlem77 here, and today in the Bonnie of Isaac, we're going to continue with the random runs because they've been really good at mixing it up, and this one's no different. Good old Maggie here. It's always fun to play with different characters. What? Another positive thing is that it's not an XL floor. Always got to be thankful for that. And we got our item room right away, but first... Man, there's a lot of enemies in this room. Piercing tears? Sure, I guess that's fine. Not a really common item, but it'll help out, that's for sure. I just have to watch out for the fact that it gives no more knockback. And remember... Take the soul hearts. But now I can grab it. Famine. Oh, I don't have any bombs. That kind of sucks. Oh, that also kind of sucks. Okay, good. You killed your fly. Get rid of that one. That one's more annoying. not going to chase me? I was kind of hoping that you'd chase me. That also sucks. I lost my soul hearts. Well then. Only one fly on the field. Ooh, gotta be careful. Gotta be careful. Sure. Kind of sucks I can't get to that tinted rock. I think I... Okay, wait. What was in this room? I see something here, but... Oh, I did see that chest in the corner. Yeah. That's why there's a little marker in that room. But at least I got a key for this next floor. For this next item room. Which just so happens to be right here. And... Gotta be careful. Oh, well, would it give me another key anyways? Yeah, you know what? I'll take this. Should be a bit better than Yum Hearts. I, there's a lot more important things than better space for item at this point. I'm talking about you, damage upgrades. Love some more damage upgrades. Not getting close. That's the reality of the situation here. No way I'm getting close to that guy. Sure, more keys. Bring them on. Okay, well. Can't say my dodging has been spectacular. But I'll still try and make do. And I should, should be somewhat fine here. Guys, no problem. There's both a positive and negative to piercing tears. That no knockback can sometimes really hurt. Uh, let's do this first. Um, dead cat. Oh, if I'm gonna grab it, might as well grab it sooner rather than later. That's my theory. Be afraid to die here. That yeah, would be fine. But also don't try. Don't try to die. Gotta save that for more important things. And that should do it for the room. And ah, uh, okay. I don't think I can make it to the secret room. I don't have any bombs. But that's not the end of the world. I don't think. Could be. Gemini shouldn't be a problem. I don't have much speed. That's where my spacebar is going to come in handy. 
Almost looks like I should be getting a soul heart since that one little part is blue. But don't quote me on that. Could be wrong. Nice and easy, and it, pretty nice that this guy was blue because it makes him a lot slower. Although, again, piercing tears, no knockback. Both positive and negative. It's going to be predictable, but can't really trap him. So I'll just make my slow circles all the way around, and everything will be fine. Not even going to need to use my space for item. And you know what? That's why I took Dead Cat right away. Just so maybe I can build up some health. Let's go to this item room right away. Is that better? I don't know. Either way, I don't want to see either of these again. But if I... I might as well use it at least... The one that I don't want to keep, I might as well use it at least once, right? See if I can find an arcade since this is an XL floor. An arcade could be a good use for the unicorn horn. Come on. Don't be scared. You guys almost hit me. Thanks to not being scared. That guy really almost hit me. Okay, gotta be smart. Ooh, not super smart. I'm not in a good spot. Not in a good spot. Okay, that's a bit better. Gotta save that other key. Oh, we got an arcade already. Wonderful. That arcade's gonna be nice and useful. To get me some extra money. I got two... Well, I got the chariot and my little unicorn, so... Double the power. Let's go grab that. Take it all the way over here. And then up here. To the right. And up. Come on. Maggie's pretty slow too, actually. Two. Three. Okay, nice. Got four plays out of it. Only gained three cents for that. What? Three cents I wouldn't have gotten otherwise, so might as well. Every little bit can count. And let's mix it up a little bit. Let's go this way. Come on, come back here. Easy now. Wonderful. That, oh, oh, if I get a bomb, I know what I'm spending it on. That should be a no brainer. Pierce and Tears, very helpful. Okay. I know what to do. Boss trap room and an arcade. It's a wonderful combination of rooms on any floor. Just go around and around. I'll be back. See if I can get five cents otherwise, but if not, that's a good backup option. Should have let them blown it up. Sure. PhD, that's pretty good. Actually, I probably should have saved that. Because I can refill my health up just a little bit. Not fully, but... I think like two hearts or something, and that's all I would have really needed. Let's go this way. And going around. Red hearts? Sure. Oh, okay, yeah. If you want to do that. Oh, why? Why? Why me? Why me? Oh. Please, no. 
Everybody, stop. Why was that room so bad for me? But I got bombs. So I think it was worth it. Trade a bomb for a bomb. That's just a needless risk. And that's also pretty needless if you ask me, but... Maybe I'll need some money for a different shop, too. Get that. Wonderful. Now I can get some more money. And I can see the rest of the floor, too. Okay. That's good. First check this out. Slot machine, that's pretty gross. And we're playing this thing twice. Okay, we're playing this thing once, getting the ivy bag. We're playing that twice. May walk around with the ivy bag instead of mob's bra here, but that's a decision I'll have to make after I fight the bosses. And hopefully get a deal with the devil. That's... Maybe it's not looking too good, but... I still think it's possible. Come on, something nice. Squeezy something nice. More tears will be helpful. And... More soul hearts, always nice. Therefore, Squeezy is definitely worth fighting some bosses for. Since Monster is only just one thing here, I'm going to be fighting some Larrys. And there's more. There's like three Larrys. Only one Monstro. I think Mob's Bra is going to be best used on the Larrys. Or I can maybe single out one of them. Get rid of one of them right away. And help with all the chaos that could happen. I can get rid of two. Wow. Okay, awesome. That went better than expected. It's always good when that happens. It's only like a three room charge, so that's, that's pretty good. I should go back, but eh, whatever. I'm lazy. I'm sure I'll find some red health along the way. Now, which way is the best possible direction for the boss rooms? So I'd like to head in that direction first. And I think I know where they are. I got a hunch. And I think it's a pretty good one. Pretty good hunch. And get rid of these spiders very systematically. Just the one, two, three, and four. Get that bomb and that penny. That was a good first little movement. Now I gotta get out of this. And that is the golden ticket. Perfect. Wonderful. That will work out too. Get some more free money. If I just am brave enough to walk around these things. Maybe not around, but in between. And of course I'm brave enough. You just gotta be cautious, that's all. Don't know why I went here. Maybe not the smartest thing to do. Especially with red nubs. But that was unknown at the time. That there would be red nubs. Go, go. Go. Get rid of them. Okay, now that I'm thinking about things, maybe taking Squeezy right away wasn't super smart. Probably should have taken them after the boss rooms. Just because if I do get a deal with the devil, that would... Okay, well, let's wait let's see what that is. Tears up, nice. That could potentially kind of make me want to lose both my red hearts. You know what, this will be good enough. And that could make me go back down to one red heart and I would actually need some soul hearts again. And Squeezy would be perfect for that. 
Alright, I got another HP upgrade, so... Maybe not to worry, unless I want both of those... Items. But then I'll become... Eh, I don't know. We'll have to see. Wait and see. Um, be smart, be smart. Don't be dumb. No deals with the devil, huh? Well, now it doesn't really matter what order I took things in. So I'm gonna get to keep them all. Unless I find a Joker card, huh? A game? Yeah, it's unlikely. 21 cents, that's pretty good. I may actually buy that pill from the shop since I have PhD. Maybe not. I'm not 100% sure either way. Come on. I don't want to walk out of my little area. I would not have ended well if I didn't use it. I'm just going to say that. Things would not have gone well. Both almost done. Let's go down here. Oh, free money. Oh, what am I doing? Easy now. That went pretty nice. Get rid of like four things at once. Thinking about, huh, Mr. Nub? Yeah, nothing important. Well, I think that's gonna do it for the floor. Oh, maybe not. Gotta buy that pill. Waste some money on a pill. Probably gonna end up being bad gas. But you never. Health up. Oh man. Just bought a health up for five cents. Now there's a deal. That's a deal that I can get behind. Maybe I should have kept that pill. Now that I'm thinking about it once again. Ah, uh, mom's bra has been pretty good. But ivy bag could be good also. Really boost up my money production. But I got treasure map anyways. Should be able to go to secret rooms. If I find another boss trap room and there's no blood bank, that's gonna it's gonna sting a little bit. That's the only thing I can think of though. Oh, that was close. But you know what? This is why I kept mom's bra here. For those scary rooms that I'm just not sure of. Just gotta use it and be safe. Just like that. There's some nice money. Would not have been nice if there was no nickel there, but luckily for me, a fine looking nickel. Now, these big ones. I don't know why the red ones still blow up or make an explosion. That is something that's kind of dangerous. Make an explosion and shoot up like little bullets or pellets. Tears of their own, I don't know. Something. Grab that one. I mean, maybe I would if I had more keys, but I don't. I just have one. And there's looking like a few doors that I want to open. Both item room and shop. So, not looking like the smartest thing to get a soul heart for a key. Well, there's that too. Could use the chariot over there. Try and get something out of it. But that also doesn't seem... Like the best use of the chariots. 
Although I don't really know what is. Gotta be honest there. And goodbye. There's my next key. Wonderful. There's my item room. Thank you, piercing tears. Could spend two bombs. I'll have to think about that. And hopefully the shop does not have greed. I know that I said what I just said pretty much makes sure that there's going to be greed in the shop. And I hope what I said made sense there. It's pretty... Yep, there we go. There's greed. Let's do this. Should be somewhat helpful. Get that Cuban meat in there. But not again. It's too risky otherwise. Okay, Mr. Super Greed. You may be able to hit me once. That's about it. Got a few shots on both of you. Thanks to the power of piercing tears. I'd love to go to that curse room, but doesn't seem super likely. And you know what, let's do this. Save myself that key. And well. Good thing I saved the key, because it's only telepathy for dummies. And that's not that great of an item. Should I save the key for here? Oh, that's not a bad trade. Would have used both bombs anyways, so... Pretty much gained a penny. Yay. As much as I don't like this room, kind of have to fight it. Oh well, we want to look on the plus side again. I can go to the curse room without too much consequence now. So that's a positive. And just make my way there now. Because that seems smart. Please be good, please be good. That's okay. Nothing fantastic. I was really hoping for a guppy item, obviously. Because even though it's a long shot at this point, still hoping for guppiness. Don't know why I did that. Sometimes I just do things without thinking. No, it's definitely one of those times. Nice I can get rid of the nub a lot easier, or at least distract the nub. Oh, I got another key anyways. So I'm fine. At least I should be fine with keys. That was close. For many different reasons. Okay, wonderful. And around. Not bad. Free money, sure. I'll I'll do deal with that. That's fine. Zombies, that's all good. Come back here, zombie. And sure, why not add another bomb? When to really use mom's bra. Maybe I shouldn't use it just in case I see Krampus. Because I don't think I'll have any real problems. Although that was kind of close. But let's just let's just save it for that just in case there's a situation with some of those small gishes that I can't deal with. Doesn't seem too likely though. And wonderful. 
getting hit by a pretty easy boss. That's never a good thing. There we go. I'm really guessing that's the tears and tears that makes it so easy to get rid of his little guys. Yeah, it's gotta be piercing tears. And he's almost gone. He is gone. I actually did get a deal with the devil. Fairly surprised about that myself. And look at that, it's Krampus. Get that cube of meat in there, get that cube of meat in there. Okay, now run away. Well, it's not what I was hoping for. That's what I'm gonna get. Krampus. And my lump of coal. You can stop me while you're slowed down. Good luck with that. Yeah, that's that's pretty much it for the floor. Looking for the shop. There's an arcade. That's pretty good. I got pretty good tears, if you ask me. And what's in here? Yep, okay, the usual. Unfortunately, I have to deal with the Kropos here. That's always a big negative in my books. Kropos is pretty tricky. Okay, didn't want to chase me. That's fine. Ooh, three cents. The difference maker. And I have to try and buy pretty much everything from the shop. Really regretting taking that dead cat now. But it's like the first deal with the devil room. I mean, I feel like I want to take a chance. It's unfortunate that chance isn't working out for me. I got one more real good possibility left for a deal with the devil. And I'll see if that works out for me. That's definitely a stretch. I just gotta have hope. Not sure I'm gonna deal with that boss trap room. I mean, I got the arcade to help me out. But, gonna have to recover my health somehow. Okay, piercing tears, I need you to work your magic. Definitely working its magic by making these guys spawn a lot of stuff at once. But that's no problem for me. What was that one? What was that one? Oh, I forget. That was a tears upgrade. I'll buy one of those. I'll buy one of these. I'll buy one of those. Oh boy, let's go to the shop, actually. Hold your horses. I could use that. Oh, I could really use that. <laughs> well then. So much for wanting to become guppy. But, yeah. I could use the hermit to become, I don't know, to get back after the boss fight. So that could be useful. We could spend some money here too. Try and get a soul heart. Or two. Or three. Or four. Or a bloody penny. Which, you know what? I actually will take. I'll take the bloody penny. Oh, what's this? Um, that may be the tarot card they take after. Okay, just gonna let that be now. And then, hmm. Okay, gonna have to somewhat plan this out here. Oh, 
Don't forget about that. That's nice. Can't get to that. Now, don't pick up any... Oh, three cents. Don't pick up anything. Till I get down to... Okay, good. Get down to the health that I want. Just leave that money there. Make my way to the boss trap room. I could go from here to the mom fight with the emperor card, but that doesn't seem very smart. Because I can't take... Eh, you know what? I need more speed. Okay, let's slow you down. That. Keep eating them. And peep. You know what? Peep is going to be worth using that. Maybe I should have used it a little bit later. Or maybe it's going to work out just fine. Okay, wonderful. Now, thinking things through, because... I actually want to do that for a change. Grab that health. Make my way back down to the arcade. See what health I can get out of all this. In here, this big mess. Okay, not great. But not terrible either. Okay, now we're talking. This blood bank is paying out with a lot. And that means I can just keep playing it. Now if only Bloody Penny could be just that much better for me. And there we go, that's the ticket. Let's play these guys just a small amount. Really just for funsies, but sometimes funsies is okay. Uh, I don't know what's with all the money, all of a sudden. I don't care. Get rid of this fly. As long as I can still play one thing, that's fine by me. Where's the D20 when you need it? I mean, this is pretty awesome. D20 plus Bloody Penny. Take note, that's a pretty good combo. And I'm not going to spend too much time here. 65 looks like the number that I'm going to stick to. And I'm still going to stick to nine, or 65. This should be it, unless I get more money. No, I'll get a key. That's pretty good. Another bomb and key, all useful. No soul hearts, that's kind of expected though. Oh yeah, sure, just run into them. Gotta have to be smart about all this. Um, taking a lot of damage. This small rock. Taking way too much damage. But that's okay, it's only red health, right? Oh, that's not red health. Don't think that's even gonna help. If anything, it slows me down, makes me a bit worse. So don't ask me why. I just did. Uh huh. Scare that spider. Not scared of getting hurt because I know I can refill. A lot of refilling can happen here. Install something like that. Easy. Lots of red health still. 
should be going to this boss with full health. I'd be extremely disappointed if I didn't. Nothing can stop me. Not your stupid rocks. Not your stupid hurts. Nothing. Okay, sure. I'll take some blue flies. Just don't want to lose those blue flies. Oh, getting hit sucks. Seem to do that a lot though. Get hit that is. Well, that went pretty nicely. Okay, that way. Just rest in there. Get rid of that one. Might as well crowd control that way too. Sure. Oh, with PhD, this could be real good. More tears. What's this one? Huh? What's this one? Speed upgrade. That can make up for the small rock. Dumb decision. More tears. More tears. More tears, more tears. Yeah, it doesn't really help that much. Wait a minute. Okay, now my range is still decent enough. Grab that. Take that. Hermit away. What's this? Chariots? You know what? May not be super great. But I'm gonna use it. In the best way that I think I can. And that's to pick up the Emperor. <laughs> play this. Oh, I thought I could play it twice and get out of there. Oh well. Let's keep playing this now that I'm stuck. Get some health. Get some health. I know you got soul hearts for me. Somewhere in there, deep down, you got a soul heart for me. Or another tarot card. Uh-huh. The Hermit. Again. Don't need a second Hermit card. I'll grab it before it's gone. It's gone. It's all gone. Well. If anything, it's worth grabbing, right? Grab it, get some invincibility frames, and... Get my soul heart back again. I don't care about that. Maybe I should should care about it, but I don't. Red patch? No, not really. Okay, I'm almost done here. 40 cents. 40 cents and I'm out. I mean, the soul heart win ratio is pretty low. Oh, but I do want to see what that is. Uh-huh. Okay. Two of diamonds. Okay. There's no way I'm going to exit with what I want here. Never mind. I guess there is a way. Oh, oh, oh. That's okay if I played it once. I got the soul heart without getting hit. Now if I can just leave without getting hit like that. Wonderful. Just wonderful. Now I'm slightly concerned with this one room that I have to walk by, but I got some good speed. This is the room. Easy. Now let's see if I got lucky. No, not super lucky. Oh well. Ooh, I know where to go. Am I going to go there? That's a good question. Probably could have tried to play for a pretty fly. But I just played it a lot of fortune teller and a lot of slot machine. So I don't really feel like playing that right now. I do want to see who this is. 
Super pride. Get me out of there. Okay, those things explode kind of fast. Please be a good tarot card. That makes up for getting hit once. That's for sure. And I'm going to go to the shop. Okay, wasn't expecting to get, rid to get rid of those other two. But that works out. I'll take that. Uh-huh, get hit myself. That's always smart. Uh, let's do this. And... Okay, good. I think that was a good use of mom's bra. Is this a good use of a key? Eh, not really. But maybe, all at the same time. Did I get hit by the explosion? How did I not get hit there? And how did I get hit by my explosion? I mean, it cancels it out, so I'm fine with it, but... I'm also disappointed by, by the game. like more health and this is what temperance is going to be good for playing two of these at once uh yeah not sure if I should keep this or not but I think I will why am I doing this I don't know oh of course it's chub it's not worth it to use necronomicon here Not worth it. Grab that, keep going back. Take this, and I am gonna head in this direction still. See what's up here. Uh huh, of course. Keep going. There we go. Finally, a half decent use. saves me just a little bit of trouble not too much but enough for it to be worth it got some red health here and there but not an extreme amount um let's do this okay a little bit closer that's maybe too close nope it's fine that's nice. Oh, good layout. Uh huh. And I think that's about it. Until I grab a half red heart, which has got to be somewhere, right? Yeah. Play them both for a little bit. I'll take that. And you know what? I'm not even going to worry about the other one. Just because I don't think I can worry about the other one. But the big, for me, the big question here is do I go for health or better ability to put out damage. I think I'm going to go with health, although it's a real tough choice. Actually, uh, I don't know. That's a real tough choice. I know I made it kind of quick, but I was thinking about it for a long time. And I think health could be good. Really gonna miss making some rooms easier though. Gotta get rid of those worms. 
Gotta get rid of those worms. Oh, that was way too close. But hey, look at that. It's gonna work out. Good, I need more keys. And I spent a couple on this floor. Uh, second level key with meat could be good for me. You're really not helping yourself here, Mr. Death. Okay, that was nice. go. That's better. Something. Oh, you got slowed down. Oh, he's dead. Um, well, don't know what I'm exactly looking for, but I'll see what I can get. Haha, <laughs> you're funny, game. Yeah. Demon baby for two red hearts. It's ridiculous. Do I go back and play the butt bank? I think the answer is going to be no. A boss trap room and an arcade and a library. Oh boy. Christmas has come early. Or late, depending on when you watch the video. And back there. Over here. Oh, there's a rock there. Oh, I didn't get rid of that diglet. Okay, goodbye, diglet. Oh, was this one? Speed upgrade. Ah, uh, you know what? No thanks. I'm gonna take a pass on that. And then you can step on the spikes. Give me a key. And I don't know why I even want to go here. Pretty much seen everything that I want to see from the library. Maybe I would have wanted a book of sin, I'm not sure. Where are you going? Okay, good. Many, many brains are down, and that makes it a lot easier. Man. Easy. Easy choice. And two free soul hearts. Thank you, hidden tinted rock. Uh huh. Yeah, this could not go well. Or it could go really well. It's really not up to me. It's up to those lust things and how they want to cooperate. Take some extra luck. I can use it at this point. Down here, over there. Round and round. Grab that. Uh, let's check out the secret room for funsies. Oh yay, so much fun. I already have 99 cents. Could have skipped this room actually. Gotta aim for that eyeball. Can't just run around willy-nilly in circles. Wonderful. One shot there, one shot there. Oh, I didn't get rid of the eyeball. That will get rid of him. I'll get rid of that one. It makes my decision easy on which side to go to. The side without the thing potentially screw me over. Where's that Mr. Mega when you need it? I'd love to grab Mr. Mega sometime. Among other bomb upgrades also. But I guess I didn't really need Mr. Mega. Yeah, just the Hermit. 
I got a more useful teleportation card of some sorts. Curse of Darkness. Could be worth it to use the Emperor here. I mean, it really could be worth it. Seeing as I could just know where to go on the next floor. But on this one, I could be wandering around for a long time. Oh, I thought that Gertie Jr. hit me right away there. Really? That didn't kill the fly? That's one tough fly. Speaking of tough flies, let's see how tough that one is. Not very. What's down here? Huh? Oh, I found the boss room. Maybe it was a smart thing to keep playing some rooms every now and then. Oh, why did I use a bomb? Not... <laughs> It's a good question. But yeah, I'm gonna save some rooms on the chest. Unfortunately, I do only have one orbital. And I'm um, already running low on health and the fight's not going that great. I slow down my, my shots from my other guys. And just really focus on only hitting him with bombs. I mean, other stuff would be okay, but not as good as bombs. Bombs are the best in this situation. In every situation. No, not every situation. But, I think I'll fight one room. Oh, thank you, Mr. Mega. I'll take that. More health. Could screw me over, but whatever. Check this out. And that's actually what I wanted. I want to see greed. And he's gonna give me the onk. Well, that's fine. But greed is basically just an easy, easy room to beat in terms of other chest rooms. So I got some health, I got the Emperor. And Mr. Mega. Mr. Mega is the biggest plus here. Pretty much without a doubt. Oh, well, pretty cheap way to do it, but hey, look at that. I got a perfect chest run. Never got hit on the chest. Of course, I only did beat two rooms, but whatever. And Mr. Mego is probably the main reason for that. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. My luck kind of turned around there once I got uh, Dr. Fetus and from there it was pretty much smooth sailing. And if you did enjoy this video, you can feel free to show your support by leaving a like. You can also comment and or subscribe. If you have an idea for a challenge run, feel free to leave that in the comment section below. If you want to see more Bonnie of Isaac videos, I got plenty on my channel so I'd recommend that you check those out. And as always, until next time, thanks for watching.